currently Sunday and it's 3.30 in the afternoon and all I want to do for the rest of the day is watch my comfort movies, eat some sushi, put on a face mask, and go to bed early. That may not sound very exciting for some of you, but to me, it sounds like the perfect Sunday. So that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna go get some sushi. I'm gonna go get some snacks. I'm gonna get some face masks. For how not exciting those plans are, I'm actually very excited. So let's get the video started and yeah. First, I have to place my sushi order, and I'm so hungry right now that I wanna get a lot of food, and I know I'm gonna regret that later when I'm like full after like two rolls. But right now, getting one of everything sounds really tempting. Also, I'm gonna get some for my brother because whenever I have like nights like these where it's like, oh, I wanna stay home and like, you know, do a face mask and watch a movie and just have a relaxing night, I always love to be home alone. Like, I do it on nights where I know no one's gonna be home and I can just be home alone and just really embrace the introvert that I am. But today my brother's gonna be home so we're just gonna have to deal with that because i still want to have a relaxing cozy amazing night so he will just be there in this video really quick to talk to you guys about today's sponsor which is hero cosmetics so thank you so much to them for sponsoring today's video hero cosmetics believes in super powered skincare for all and that everyone deserves to feel comfortable in their skin they have their super popular product called the mighty patch which i honestly love because in a pimple emergency it's exactly what you need i've used the mighty patch countless times especially the nights before either like i'm going to be filming or i'm going to be going out and i have one of those pimple emergencies i definitely just throw one on and i'm good to go the next day they are the best way to extract whiteheads and 90 percent of the their consumers said it removed the gunk from their pimple overnight. It's smarter than Zit Cream and way better than popping because it naturally extracts the pimple without hurting your skin. It's medical grade, vegan, cruelty free, and safe for pregnant or nursing women. And it's available worldwide. I'm also a huge fan of the Mighty Patch nose patches because when you're taking it off, you could literally see how much gunk it takes out of your skin. I wear it overnight because you can wear it from six to eight hours and then you wake up in the morning, you take it off. My favorite part is that it's completely pain free zero pain which any other like nose patch that i would use it was so painful to take off i've only used them a couple times and after that i was so scarred because every time you're like ripping it out it literally feels like you're ripping it off your skin this one's completely pain free it's amazing and you can visibly see how much gunk it's taking out of your skin with no pain like how amazing is that it doesn't irritate sensitive skin it's 100 percent safe and fda approved and it's affordable. They also have a lightning wand that helps fade dark spots in not weeks, but days. You can apply the lightning wand twice a day and it's so easy to take on the go. I've been using these Mighty Patch products for months now and I love them. If you have a stubborn pimple, if you have a pimple emergency, or if you're having pore trouble, these products are amazing. Like I said, you can wear them from six to eight hours. You literally wear them in your sleep. You're doing something good for your skin and helping your skin out while you're sleeping, which is like, it doesn't get better than that. Thank you so much to Hero Cosmetics for sponsoring this video and thank you to them for making products that actually work and that help us get out of those skin emergencies and for making it affordable so thank you so much to them and let's get back to the video click the link down below and use my coupon code carla15 to get 50 percent off plus free shipping on orders over 35 dollars so yesterday i went to ulta and i went in like trying to look for a face mask because i really want to get like a face mask that i know is going to actually do something for my skin because i feel like every time i do a face mask it's one of these and it's more of like the experience like i like putting on a face mask and like feeling super relaxed but i don't really think it's doing anything for my skin but the face mask that i wanted was like 80 dollars so i need to find a face mask that's actually gonna work but that also leaves me being able to pay my rent so uh, for now i'm gonna stick to my cute little three dollar ones i'm gonna go pick up my sushi now we got it it smells so freaking good okay let's go home i cannot wait to watch a rom-com or just a really cute movie with my sushi i'm thinking i'm gonna watch Monte Carlo. So yesterday I actually made a playlist and it happens to be one of my favorite playlists I've ever made. I literally titled it Dancing Around My Room. It's a bunch of songs that I don't usually listen to or a bunch of artists that I don't usually listen to, but it's those type of songs that no matter what you're doing or what mood you're in, it's instantly gonna make you want to dance around your room and it's gonna make your mood a lot better. So I put a bunch of those type of songs into a playlist and I've been listening to it all day long. Like literally I did so many errands today. Today was like my Sunday reset type of situation. I was doing laundry, I was cleaning my fish bowls, I was cleaning my room, I was like washing the bathroom, it was the whole thing and the entire time I had that playlist going. I was trying to look for this one song that had like such a good summer feeling to it and I remember that I listened or I heard it 
in the Beverly Hills Chihuahua movie and I couldn't remember what it was called so I searched up on Spotify I was like Beverly Hills Chihuahua soundtrack <laughs> and I found it I literally found it and I'm obsessed with that song and now it's in my playlist if you needed to hear something to brighten your day go listen to that playlist dance around your room don't give a what you look like and thank me later <laughs> using those target nails they were literally only like seven dollars and they're kind of cute but they're kind of funky looking so i don't get my nails done until tuesday but until then these will do i mean they look a little better there in person they look a little funky and that might have been because i didn't apply them correctly but it took me like 30 minutes to, <laughs> to be able to find my size and like glue them on and i feel like if i go like this they're gonna fall off but for $7, I'm, I'm down for these. So right now I'm gonna watch maybe like the first movie of the night because I'm thinking I can watch two today. But I'm gonna watch a movie and I'm gonna eat my sushi and yeah, I'm gonna enjoy life for a second. I have the worst food coma right now and I really don't want to get out of bed, but I'm going to. I'm going to put on a face mask, I'm going to take an in-depth shower, and after that I'm going to get back into bed and watch another movie probably. I watched Freaky Friday this past week, I watched Mr. and Mrs. Smith, which I love, and what else did I watch? And yesterday I started a movie, but I didn't finish it, so I think I'm going to finish that one later. It's called Just My Luck, it's literally one of my favorite rom-coms ever ever since i was little i've been obsessed with that movie i literally wanted to be Lindsay lohan so bad if you guys know about just my luck or if you've watched just my luck we're on a whole different level of friendship right now because i love that movie and no one seems to know about it or anybody that i honestly don't know about that movie and i've been obsessed with that one since i was like in fourth grade so if you're a rom-com movie lover like me you need to watch that movie immediately my closet situation is disgusting let's not even look at that that was not part of the sunday reset i basically did a bunch of laundry and then put it back so now everything is clean clothes it's just not put away that's a chore for tomorrow okay now i'm gonna take off my makeup and i'm gonna do a cute little face mask i feel like i just put on my makeup like literally three hours ago and now i'm gonna wash it off but today was one of those days where i literally spent like 30 minutes on my makeup only for me not to love the way that i came out so I'm very excited to wash it all the way right now. So I would say in the past like two weeks, I've actually been getting into skincare because I mentioned this in another vlog already, but I had like no skincare routine at all. Like it was literally just moisturizer and that was it. But now I'm actually like, I don't know. I just don't want to get wrinkles like when I'm like 32 and I don't want to regret not taking care of my skin when I'm this age. So I've been putting together a little skincare routine. I feel like it's not like there's still so many products I want to try out and start using. But for now, I'm using like an eye cream and I'm using this cute little thing which is Paula's Choice um, exfoliator situation I don't know but I heard really good things about it so I'm gonna show you guys today um, all the products that, I mean it's not a lot but all the products that I've been using um, to build a little skincare routine for myself starting with the CeraVe hydrating cleanser this is the cream to foam and i've literally had it for like two months and i want to finish it so bad already because i don't like this one this one's the cream to foam and i just like the regular one i want to try this one out but this one burns my eyes so bad um versus the other hydrating one the regular one doesn't burn my eyes at all so yeah but 
The Cerebi ones are great. Okay, now that my skin is makeup free, I'm gonna go in with a little face mask. 